Hey everybody, welcome back to Hard West. Uh, we're gonna jump into sieging this homestead, and hopefully this is indicating that we're gonna get the jump. We might have a setup phase, um, and we might be able to kind of ambush the ambushers, if that makes sense. Let's, uh, let's see what happens, see how it goes. You can see armed thugs roaming your homestead. Uh, we can attack or sneak in through the escape tunnel. Oh. Well, I mean, yeah, let's try that. Everybody's pretty much set up already. We got some new items that we may or may not have a chance to use. We've got lots of cards going on. It's, uh, yeah, let's go. Remember, father left for whatever reason. He's gone. We are cursed and we have damnation. We basically sold our soul to the devil and we have minus 10 max luck. It's bad. Things are bad. But I mean, we had to do it. Kind of. We didn't have to, but... <laughs> they learn soon enough what happens when you try to take a man's home. You would fight for your home and take back what was yours. The tunnel you used was mighty useful and led you all the way into the house. Okay. So it led us into the house, but... The enemy knows we're here, correct? Is that what I'm coming to understand here? Okay, where are they, though? I don't see any. I'm trying to look for some shadows. We do have a box in the middle that we can make into some better cover if necessary. What's out here for now? Oh, shit! This is a bit of a problem. We got one right above us. We can take him out. One! Okay, never mind. That's right. He's in cover from that spot. Uh. Gain demonic strength. I guess. If we're gonna use. Like, can we even use melee weapons? Not really. So is that, is that just HP? I'm not sure exactly. Let's go here. This guy's flanked. He should be no problem. Well, unless... Unless we miss, of course. Damn it. Okay, what about you, Florence? There we go. Alright, so not really the ideal start. I should have looked room by room. I didn't think they would be this close. We have one above, we have one trying to flank. Okay. Now let's take Warren. Let's put him right here. We can show this guy what's up. Oh, but we're gonna get that Overwatch. I don't like that. Let's see what our other options are. You can come at him from inside. Oh, that's what I forgot to do, is give old Ike another weapon. I was thinking about that. But I didn't do it. There we go. There's one. Okay, let's tuck Florence into this corner here. Oh, and actually, this might be a great opportunity for a Shriek. We could probably take out both of them. That's wild. I love that. Okay. And then Warren. Ugh. Oh. I mean, 
mean, we could take the shot, but... We're not going to dish out the damage that we need to. I could just dash him back here. Or I could try and... We could start working down the hallway. Let's go here for now. And let's go dodge. Oh, we can actually still shoot too, so we might as well. He's probably going to shoot for uh, old Ike anyways. Oh, he missed. Beautiful. Now, do they always... Yeah, it looks like they're always have this overwatch which is great for them not so much for me let's head up should be able to take him down if we get this hit which hopefully happens there it is time was that those hired thugs worked for the railroad the corrupt local government deeded them your property, claiming the right of eminent domain. Making the house you were defending no longer yours. Wait, what? The man you killed raised the reward on your head a little higher. Oh, because no. Because now you were a wanted man. An outlaw. That's fantastic. And sarcastic, of course. Okay, let's come in here. We should be able to kill this guy. Oh my god. I gotta get him another weapon. Let's have Warren come and do it. Come on. There it is. Two left, hopefully entice the guy by the window to move. Looks like he might still be there. Uh, I don't see him. Let's move up. Move Warren in. Okay. Reload. There he is. This should be fairly doable. There it is. Come on, Ike. Nice job. Now, where's the last one? I don't think we have another one in the house. Hello, yeah we do. I was wrong. Okay, I don't like this spot, but... Was silenced. That works. Of your situation finally hit home. So, you due to some to technicality in the law, <laughs> we're at fault for defending our own home. So that scenario is complete. That's pretty cool. Uh, so what does that mean now? So now we can either go down here. 
Solomar Delir unexpectedly inherits great wealth in a dangerous mission. To cure the madness spreading across the region, aided by a mysterious benefactor, he delves even deeper into the unexplored reaches of the human mind. Or, as good as dead, your rootless but happy times of drifting are violently interrupted when you cross the wrong man. But a powerful stranger helps you to rise up, transforming you from a carefree gambler into the personification of vengeance. Okay, so are these completely separate stories? This is so bizarre. Very interesting how this works. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what. Um, I will stop here. I know it's going to be quite... A sh it's going to be quite a bit of a shorter episode, but this is all new, so I, I don't think it makes sense to start a new scenario here. I'll do that as uh, an additional episode, but uh, I'm not sure how this plays out. And what are these skulls? Oh, that's the difficulty in which we completed it. And then there's these things underneath. I'm not sure. So presumably, each of them has a completely separate story. Maybe they all kind of tie together in some way. Uh, it looks like here, like, it looks like this is Warren. But this guy's brand new. Aided by a mysterious benefactor, he delves even deeper into the unexplored reaches of the human mind. Huh. Okay. I'm probably gonna continue here, because I want to see what happens with Warren. Uh, so probably take on as good as dead. But, uh, I like all these different scenarios. This is, this is actually an interesting way of doing things. So, uh, yeah. We'll take a break here. When we come back, we'll do uh, as good as dead. So, wish me luck, guys. See you then. Bye.